To look like any Disney princess, you'll need your Disney eyes. I'm wearing circle lenses to enlarge the size of my iris. This gives you that doll-like appearance. Snow White has beautiful, flawless skin, so make sure you medicate your skin if you have any acne or small blemishes. Also, because your skin is so white, use a sufficient amount of sunscreen. This will refract any light on your face, making your skin look whiter. Use a foundation a few shades lighter than your own, and apply it evenly on your face. Don't cake on your foundation. Use a sufficient amount. We don't want the makeup to look caked on, so blend it to make it look natural. We're trying to achieve a flawless canvas. Disney princesses are flawless because, well, they're cartoons. You don't really see pimples on Disney princesses, but I'm sure they have their bad days too. Now set your foundation and concealer with powder. I always make sure to use powder because foundation and concealer underneath will slip and slide if you don't use powder on top. This will keep the foundation locked in. The fun part: wearing the wig. I usually wear my wig at the end, but for the sake of this tutorial, I'll wear it during the makeup. This will really set the mood, and you can see the transformation better. So make sure the wig fits on snugly. No stray hairs sticking out. Also, don't forget your companion, a blue jay. I bought him at Michael's Arts and Crafts, and I'll put him on my shoulder because, well, it'll keep me company. Now, moving on to eyeshadows, Snow White wears brown eyeshadow, but I found white shimmering eyeshadow prettier to use. It reflects light better too, making your eyes appear bigger. So apply it along the lids and the inner corner of your eyes to help bring in more light. Snow White has black eyebrows, but I always found black eyebrows a little bit too harsh. And since we want an innocent face, it's best to avoid black eyebrows and stick with a shade that's three shades lighter if your hair color is dark, three shades darker if your hair color is light. Now apply white eyeliner on your waterline. This will make your eye whites appear whiter. With liquid eyeliner, line your eyes to create a slight cat eye look. Now create another one. I call this the double wing eyeliner. This almost looks cartoonish and gives an illusion of longer lashes. Don't forget to create smaller strokes on the lower lash line. This opens the eyes more and creates that cartoon-like effect. Let's apply fake lashes on, and don't forget your lower lashes. Cut one in half and glue them near the lower lash line. Your eyes are complete. Let's move on to soft pink blush along your cheeks. You want that Disney rosy glow. Use a brush to blend the blush along the cheekbones and nose. This will bring in more warmth to your white face.
now finish off with the lips. Line your lips with a red lip liner. Doing this will create a longer lasting base for your red lips. So fill in your lips. And taking your concealer with a brush, redefine the lips by creating a stronger edge. Because of the sharpness, this will make your lips pop out. So set the concealer with powder. Now with lipstick, apply it in the middle of your lips. And using an angled brush, paint your lips on. Finish off with candy apple red lip gloss. And accessorize. Wearing a red bow really completes the look. I present to you Snow White. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Good luck and happy Halloween. Music by Nancy Danino, Reality, and Libby Linton, When You Wish Upon a Star.